Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while since um, I've done a video, but I have been sick. I was on a hiatus for a little bit and um, I was in the hospital for three weeks. I was really sick over the holiday too. So I'm just getting around now to starting to make my crafts. Um, I'm now fully recovered from the hospital, so I'm able to finish projects and um, get things sent out. But of course, Corona hit, so I'm not able to ship out as often as, you know, as I usually do. Um, just because I'm not going out, I'm considered high risk. So I'm really avoiding having to go out and... 90% of the time I am home. Um, but I did want to do a haul video uh, just to get things back um, on my channel. And this haul is from Hobby Lobby. I'm really excited. Um, I was really excited to get it because it took longer than usual. Last time I ordered from Hobby Lobby, it took less than a week to get back to me. And this time it took a little over two. Um, they have a notice on their website that says um, due to coronavirus, they have some delays. So, um, yeah, so I was a little disappointed because I did get some of this stuff for a um, challenge that I was doing. But I had to send that in um, two days ago. So... Unfortunately, my stuff did not make it in time, but that's okay um, because I can always use it some other time. So the first thing that um, we're going to look at, let's look at the little items first. So um, I mostly shopped in their sale or clearance section. Um, so at the time that I went shopping, um, these were on sale. These are actually stickers. So they're squishy, but they're stickers. Um, so I have a thing for llamas. So I bought the llama for myself. And then I also bought this kind of like milkshake sticker. Um, it was supposed to be part of the exchange that I was doing. Um, but I'll just give it to, or uh, use it in Happy Mail for someone. And then, um, I bought these. These were these cute little owls, Valentine owls. These were, I believe they were 70% off, so they came out to, um, or maybe they were half off. I'm not sure. So they came out, I think, to either a dollar nineteen or a dollar something like that so I got these and they it comes with eight or ten owls sorry and then I also got for Halloween uh, for Halloween for <laughs> Valentine's I'm all over the place you guys I'm so nervous doing my first video back so for Valentine's I also got these uh, foam stickers and they're also glittered, as you can see. They're X's and O's and um, the hearts with the arrow. And then the regular hearts, but they're scalloped hearts. So I thought those were cute and can be used, um, you know, uh, not necessarily at any time because they are red. But um, yeah, for next year. So I believe these were also a dollar or a dollar nineteen or a dollar forty nine, something like that. And then I got um, these princess stickers. It came out to ninety nine cents. So I got these. They're um, uh, what do you call them? Kind of like jemmy stickers. And so I thought these were really cute. Um, I also got these puffy stickers. They're puffy holographic stickers. Um, 
and these came out to a dollar. So I thought that was really cute. I love the animals. This was also part of the gift I was supposed to give. Um, they're, these are stickers, believe it or not. So they're unicorn stickers. I think they're kind of neat. So I might be able to use these in something or gift them for Happy Mail. And then um, I did get this collection. Um, this um, I guess pack what is this called it's the the, the kit the um, what is this this um, lol uh, scrapbook kit so I did get the kits I wanted to get these stickers because they were on sale for half off and then this was also part of um, the giveaway challenge I was participating in. But you can always use happy birthday stickers. So I'm happy to have these as extras. And then these alpha stickers were on sale for 99 cents. I did get two. I have a thing for mint green right now. So I did get two of these um, just in case I need more letters. And this was also part of the gift that I was um, giving along with the unicorn stickers. So um, this gemmy, um, big gem sticker. So this would be a great gift for, um, for Happy Mail, I think. Yeah. I'm not into unicorns, so I'd keep it, but I'm really not into unicorns at all. And then, um, I'll tell you guys a story. So, I usually get my holiday paper, any kind of holiday cardstock. I get it usually at Michael's, but um, obviously the store is closed when coronavirus hit, and I didn't get a chance to buy it any Easter you know, paper just because um, I came out of the hospital and then I was recovering and then coronavirus literally hit a week later. So um, I did, was able to get some stickers that were half off at Hobby Lobby so that I could at least decorate some stickers. I mean, decorate some paper that I already have with some Easter stickers. I told you guys I do have a thing for llamas. So these llama stickers were on sale for 99 cents. I had to get these. And then um, these are the other Easter stickers. They're glittery. They're not puffy. They're just glittery um, flat stickers. And then um, comes with two sheets each. And then... Um, when I was shopping on michaels.com, because I figured, you know, they'll either ship or I can pick up, you know, for Michaels. Um, they actually, um, maybe they closed, you know, they closed all their stores in the beginning when coronavirus hit. So, for some reason, everything was not in stock in any store um, or in stock at all so you couldn't order anything and that was for every single item I noticed so I'm I'm thinking that they you know updated their system so that no one could order because they weren't fulfilling orders at that time because no one knew if they were going back to work or now or after this whole corona thing so now that they're picking up Everything's back in stock again, of course, but, you know, since I couldn't get a paper pad from Michael's for Easter, I just decided to take advantage of the sale that Hobby Lobby is ha having on individual paper. The only reason I don't like getting Hobby Lobby paper is because it's not as thick. The cardstock isn't as thick as Michael's. So these are the patterns that I chose that were... Kind of eastery to me. 
at least. Let me just show you guys. This is the first pattern. It's just as um, like a zigzag or chevron, I guess you could say. Um, no, it's a zigzag. Um, in blue and yellow. Those weren't my favorite. Um, and then I did get the plaid, the pastel plaid. And it's vintage. So as you can see, it's kind of like has an aged look to it. So I got two sheets of those. Okay. And then I fell in love with this bunny pattern paper. So it has this purple, but it's a deeper, darker purple. So I got two of those. Then I also got this polka dotted one with different color polka dots. Um, I was hoping the dots would be smaller. I'm a little disappointed that it came out as big as it did. But that's okay. I got two of those. And then, like I told you guys, I do have a thing for mint green right now. So I did get just the solid bold stripe green. And then I also got one sheet of the pink, the thinner stripe of the dark pink. And then I got two sheets of the stuck together, sorry, of the polka dot pink and white. Um, like I said, I was hoping that the dots would be smaller. It's the same size as the, the dots are the same size as the, um, the colorful dots that I got back here. So these are all 12 by 12 sheets and they were, sorry, I was picking something up. They were four for a dollar. And then I also got two, um, I believe this is eight and a half by 11 sheet of ticket paper. So my thoughts for this are, I may want to use one for actual background of something, but uh, my thoughts for this was to cut it, you know, cut the tickets. Oh, I thought I got two. I only got one apparently. And my thoughts were to use it as cut aparts and then use them as actual tickets because I don't have a ticket um, die. Um, but yeah, so this is a regular eight and a half by 11 and then the rest are 12 by 12. Like I said, everything was four for a dollar. Um, so basically I paid, I think about two or three dollars for all this paper and maybe, um, I think this was also 25 cents or 50 if I'm not mistaken. So I did get that. Um, I did get this happy birthday kit. So as you can see, it came with um, three dimensional stickers, some holographic alpha letters, and then some cut aparts. Where are these stickers? Oh, I think they're stickers. They're birthday festive stickers. And then some gems which are cute and then look at the paper selections so I think the paper is really cute that pink one I figured I could use that for Easter paper too because there's sprinkles so it's and it's pastel-y colored or colorful rainbow colored um, the striped one the last one there I can also use for um, Easter paper if I wanted to so, um, birthday paper, I feel like you can use all year round. So even though I missed my giveaway challenge, I, um, I'm okay with having this in my stash just because I can always use it for someone else who's having a birthday. And then this is the collection I was talking about that I did purchase. 
Um, it might not be the same exact girl, but you get the idea. Um, I just meant to get the stickers to kind of like match her. Let's see if I can find them in here. Here she is. Oh, it is her. <laughs> so, yeah, just different color hair, I guess. So, yeah, I just wanted to get the stickers to match her and um, coordinate with this paper collection I got. I was really excited because I've been wanting this um, for a long time. Uh, not this particular kit, but this collection. Um, but her pad is just, it's you know, just so much for me. I don't want to spend money on a whole pad that's $20 and like this thick when, you know, I might only, that that's too much girly, you know, so I might only use this much. Um, but I look forward to using it for something. Um, these are the things, these are the, this is the paper. So we have, looks like one with a full size of her. And then the bows, which I love. I love that blue and with the black bows. The little moped, which I love also. And then the roses. Or are they um, peonies? I don't know. One or the other. And then the, um, the print, the um, city logos. So, um, that's the completion of my haul. I did forget one thing I wanted to show you guys. I opened it already because so I was so excited to try it out. Um, so I got my corner puncher, my corner rounder puncher. Um, so I was really excited because this was on sale. It was regularly $6.99 and I got it for $3.99. So, um, I believe that's half off maybe so I was really excited to get that and that's it you guys um I want to thank you guys for watching and I'm so happy that I'm making videos again and I'm back um so stay tuned for my next video share which is a project share um I will talk to you guys soon thanks for watching have a good night bye